Yo, 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 what's going on? It's your boy Shadow back again with another YouTube video. This one is for the um, Sawgrass SG800. Um, like, comment, and subscribe. This is the uh, SG800 sublimation printer. And look, man, I've been, I've been having some issues with, um, I've been having some issues with, like, getting replacement ink. And basically, you know, the replacement ink on Amazon is like 340 some dollars. And, you know, that's a little too much money for my soul. So, you know, I found this. This is what you call XCI ink or something like that. X, was it? XC ink jet. It's not ink jet ink. Um, hmm. The fuck? I'm just, I'm just open this junk. Yeah. So it just says XC ink. Okay. Yeah. X, XC ink jet sublimation ink. So they call it ink jet, but it's not ink jet for ink jet printers. It's sublimation ink. That's the brand name of it. So basically, um, yeah, I'm gonna see if this thing works in the, the Sawgrass SG 800. I got, I got a lot of, you know, um, I read the reviews on this ink. They say that the ink is, um, the ink. Mm, I'm opening it. Open up the package now. Uh, they said that the ink works better than the. Uh, this ink works better than the manufacturer's ink. So you know, on my channel, I try to make sure that you know that it does work better than this. You know, than the manufacturer's ink because I found that the manufacturer's ink. You know, it's a little dull in my opinion. Like I've I've ordered from various places uh for you know dye sublimation and transfers and then I ended up you know buying a dye sublimation printer for myself. And I felt that the ink, you know, I was a little discouraged about this little printer here. Um you know, I didn't recommend anybody to buy this, but um yeah, I was a little little deterred. And I wouldn't refer anybody to buy this printer because I didn't feel like the ink, you know, held up to its name because this is an expensive printer. So, um, yeah, hopefully this does a lot better. You know what I'm saying? These ink do a lot better than the manufactured suggested inks that you get. Now... I hope I put that shit in right. This should look kind of crazy. I don't know, y'all. All right, hold on. Let's see. All right, so what side is up? Okay, the C is up. Hmm, hmm, hmm. No, brother. It's like they're both in the middle. Okay, the top. All right, cool. So I got to put this the top side up. All right, so, oh, they have arrows. It tells you the arrows where it goes in. All right, so I'm going to put that right there. Um, the K, I don't know what the K is, but I hope that this ink is like 10 times better because the ink is certainly expensive. Um, uh, the manufacturer's ink is like $300, um, on Amazon as opposed to this ink cost me $58. Shots out to XC Inkjet. Um, so yeah, this was um, $58. I'm gonna take the key out. And once again, all this shit is um, empty. All my ink is empty. So I'm gonna throw all this back up in there. And I'm doing this on review. You know, I haven't put it in there i get it i do the reviews as i get it so that you guys see that it's an honest review there's no bullshit no kind of you know work for the company type situation this is just an honest review so if the ink doesn't work you guys are going to see it live but it might not be live but it's just going to be you know when i put it in there it's going to be sort of kind of live um, it's a real review, you know what I'm saying? So this is going in there like that. And then maybe a later video, what I'm going to do is, um, give you an update. Bam. 
give you an update on how the print quality is. So, this is going to be just the initial, initial review. And also, I, what I've noticed is that, you know, with this printer, it requires a lot of, you know, um, I believe one website, Heat Press Nation, they really advocate for the the um, text print paper. And I feel like the text print paper isn't a good quality paper. Um, so, of course, I did my research. And when I used to order from... It was another company where they would they would just charge me like a dollar or two for 16 by 20 dot sub printouts. You know, they had three different paper types. And with those three different paper types, you know, you got a different quality. So what I did was, you know, I ordered some new paper. So I was thinking maybe, you know, with this ink, the subject HD ink, which sucks. Sucks. You know, maybe this, the new ink that I bought, the $58 ink plus some new paper will bring out the bright colors from, you know, the printer. So we're definitely going to see. Um, this is what I get once I put the, the ink cartridges in there. All right. So, okay. All right. Cool. So you see all of the ink, it says ready which means that everything is good. You know what I'm saying? So, yeah, this this is a third-party ink manufacturer. And so far, everything is good. My next video is going to show you how the ink um, output produces on, you know, T-shirts and all that. Like, comment, and subscribe for the XC Inkjet Ink if you're looking for replacement ink. For your Sawgrass SG-800. I don't know if they make it. Yeah, they make it for the 400 as well. Like, comment, and subscribe. Peace out.